Let's take a look at something real quick, okay? We have what we call, going on right now, beta male energy. Beta male energy, right now going on in society. We're seeing it. Now look at these numbers right here. They have what we also call single mothers or heroes. Look at this, 1950, these are percentage of births that are to unwed women. We think single motherhood has been around for a long time. It really hasn't. This is a new concept. And they use marketing campaigns to get you to accept it. 1950s, 5%. Not a lot of children born to unwed mothers. We get to 2012, we're almost dang near half. Okay, some communities, some communities, 70% of the children born to unwed mothers. What typically happens right now, the father absence is a crisis in America. 19 million children, more than, more than, well, we're approaching half at this particular point, this is in 2017, live without a father in the home, okay? And I'm telling you this for a reason, because the guys that wanna be fathers, the four or five of you that raise your hands, probably half of you will not even raise your kid from zero to 18. You won't even have the authority to do so. The systems are already in place. They got a whole bunch of things in place for you to not be in that home. Your job is to maintain that authority. Remember I said, oh, being a father is not enough or wanting to be a father is not enough. You have to have the authority. You have to be willing to lead, okay? So what does that lead to? Kids that grow up without a father, four times as much to be raised in poverty, seven, time, seven times likely to be a teenage pregnancy victim. More likely to experience child abuse, that's normally because potentially the single mother, the co-parent has moved in another man into your domicile, into her domicile, okay? Behavioral problems. Who in here was raised with, by two parents? Okay, two, wow, look at this, okay? That represents, remember that graph I showed you? That represents that, okay? What about this, incarceration? They talk about mass incarceration. More likely to go to prison. The stat that I put in my second book, The Evolution, 73% of the prison inmates were raised in single parent households primarily single mothers, okay? Child obesity, are we seeing this today? Are we not seeing this, okay? Two times it's likely to suffer from obesity. Why? Video games, social media, we're gonna get to that. Crime, more likely to be a criminal. Somebody said one time in the 80s, oh, the numbers of uh, the, the crime rate is going down, okay? While single parenthood was going up, they wanted an explanation, well, why is that happening? Okay, it's happening because they're all in jail. <laughs> right? Can't be out there committing crime when you're already locked up. Education, two times more likely to drop out. See this? Beta male energy right here. This is beta male energy, okay? And the media can get to your kids to incite you to do anything when you don't have an authority figure around. They can incite you into this division. Now you see me, I'm black, but this right here ain't it. This ain't it. This is right here, being a victim. Now, if you have a father that's leading you, you're not gonna be a victim. If you got a father that's leading you, you're not gonna say, yeah, let's go outside, son. If you grew up with a father, you're not gonna be out there thinking that this is gonna make a difference. See, I teach my kids they're not victims. You make your own way. You design your own path. You don't go out there and yell and scream in the streets to try to force people to give you something. This is beta male energy, and I called it out. I'm not afraid to call this out on social media, okay? I called it out from day one that this ain't it, okay? What about this stuff? Anybody hear this? It's a movie called Cuties, in which these girls represent 11-year-old girls, okay? And they're in provocative poses designed to, well, the producer of the movie and the director, oh, this is a coming of age film about girls developing and, and realizing their sexuality and their power. Really? Is that what you're calling it? Because this looks like none of them had a dad. 
This looks like all of their mothers dragged them down to the audition and said, this is the only way to do it. Let's sell that peace leave. If you've been listening to my content, you know what that is. Let's sell it because that's all we got, girls. See, if these women have fathers, these young girls have fathers, you're not going to let your daughters go out there and do any of this. Okay? Even if you are in a marriage, okay, even if you're in a marriage, a lot of men right now, you're in hand-pecked relationships meaning she's the authority figure in the house. You can't even say anything about raising the kids because she believes she owns the kids. We're gonna talk about that.